Uncle Ahmed is a man of many skills. Not only does he repair broken machines, but he can also create precise mechanical parts with surprisingly simple equipment. Today he demonstrates how to make a worm gear, a complex component usually produced in advanced factories. The process begins with a block of brass, pre-cut and placed firmly in the lathe chuck. The cutting tool moves across the surface, removing material layer by layer. Brass is soft and easy to machine, so each pass of the tool feels smooth and controlled. Because a worm gear is a high precision part, every dimension must be exact. Visual observation alone isn't enough to guarantee accuracy. After the turning process, Uncle Achment polishes the brass with sandpaper, creating a smooth, uniform finish. Next, the cutting tool is changed to shape the inner bore. This step is critical, as the bore must fit the bearing perfectly. Once machined, the bearing is carefully pressed in place with light hammer strikes until it sits flush. The most challenging stage is creating the gear teeth. Without access to advanced gear cutting machines, Uncle Ahmed uses a custom-made tool of his own design. Mounted on the tool post, the cutter is aligned with great care. Measurements are marked and the cutting tap is supported by the tailstock to prevent breakage. Slowly, tooth by tooth, the gear profile begins to appear. Each cut requires patience and precision. After more than an hour of continuous work, the gear is complete. The finished piece reveals a clean, uniform set of teeth, remarkably similar to the output of a CNC machine, but produced entirely with basic tools and the steady hands of an experienced craftsman. If he can do this with brass and simple tools, imagine what Uncle Hawkmed could do with rocket fuel. Probably his own spaceship! <laughs>